What will they cook today? Learn it in the new cooking challenge by Olala. Got it. I want a corn dog. What is it? What? How can we cook it? Mm. A good question. Ah, I got it. <laughs> we can do it. Okay. Great. Start. I don't want to hesitate starting to cook. That sausage is so slimy that it literally is jumping out of my hands. That's it. Now it won't run away. Oh, no. Sorry. Nick, would you be so kind not to waste food? Gran, don't bother me. I'm going to fry the sausage right now. I need a gas stove for it. This is how it's going to get brown, easily and quickly. That's it. Oh, it seems that I've overdone it a little bit. That's not a problem. I'll hide it with the sauces. I'll pour more. Smells quite tasty. Finished. Wow, look at you, Nick. It's time for me to start cooking. For a corn dog, I'm going to need some flour. To crack a couple of eggs. And mix everything with a whisk. That's rather difficult. But I'm ready for everything for the sake of a delicious dish. Here's the dough. It's time to dip the sausage in it. I need more dough so that the corn dog becomes tastier. Looks nice. But I still need to fry it. Okay. <laughs> the pan with some oil in it has already warmed. I'll put the sausage there for a couple of sets. That's it. Oh, I've nearly forgotten about the sauce. Ketchup is never too much. Ta-da! No. Who's cooking like that? Now I'll show you a master class. Watch me and learn. Cheese always improves the dish. I'm cutting the sausage into small pieces. And stick a skewer through them in turns with cheese. You won't find this corn dog anywhere else. This is my signature dish. Now I'll make a coating and put it in the pan to fry. You see how you should cook? <laughs> Nearly done. <gasps> awesome! Yeah. Some mustard and ketchup will complement it perfectly. Cool! Mmm, magnifique. Come on! How's it going? What? Are you ready? They are all so different. This isn't a corn dog rather than a simple sausage with ketchup. Or to put it better, ketchup with sausage. Ugh. On top of all this, it's burnt. That's not what I wanted. This one looks better. I wonder how it tastes. Not bad. Unlike the first one, but could still be better. What do we have here? This is so yummy. Wow, there's even some cheese here. This corn dog is the one I like the most. Well done, chef. Very delicious. This is not what I want. This is what I need. Yummy. Scrambled eggs, that's easy. Okay. A weird choice. No problem, honey. Come on. I'll start if you don't mind. For a good scramble, it's critical to choose high quality eggs. These are quite good, I guess. I've got a well tried recipe. First, I need to separate the whites from the yolks. Now, the most exciting part I'm putting all the ingredients in the pan so that I get a funny face. There's something else left. I'll add some spices to get a brighter taste. Great, right? Wow. Not bad, but no scramble compares with Granny's. I even can do it without a pan or eggs to make it. Uh, what? Why are you staring at me? You've been thinking that Granny doesn't know any extraordinary recipes. You were wrong. I'm going to need an avocado and a quail egg. I'm cracking the egg into the pit hole. I'm baking it in the oven. It's important to set the right temperature so that the scramble is ideal. It smells wonderful. Mmm. Wow, I didn't know you could do such things. That's not all. We need to add a pinch of herbs. And don't forget about the salt. Ready. Annie's gonna love it. Respect. Oh, I nearly forgot about my own dish. What can I do? If Granny's okay. thrown all the eggs away, I'm going to get the new ones. Thanks, Hen. Now I'm ready to cook. I'll take my mug. I'll mix all the ingredients in it to make a rich scramble. And here's one more time. I'll need my favorite gas stove. 
Don't panic. This time I'm gonna be very careful. My scramble in the mug's ready. It smells good, by the way. Annie, we're ready. Try it. <laughs> Let's see what you've made me this time. Wow, is this a scramble in an avocado? Really original and tasty. Granny, that's so cool. What do we have next? A scramble in a mug. I can't do without a spoon here. Okay. Wow, can't believe it. I expected worse from you, Nick. But you've really tried hard. What has our chef made? Wow, what a nice face. Such a funny scramble. What does it taste like? Mmm, just gorgeous. Everything's so tasty that I don't really know what to choose. Anyway, the chef's dish is the funniest. I'll pick it. Wow, make a cocktail for me. If you wish so. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Okay. <laughs> Be quick, I'm waiting. The blender's mine. <laughs> first come, first served. That's unfair. Okay, I'm angry now. Look out, berries. I'll do without any blender. I'll squeeze you till nothing's left. Nick, what's up? The walls are shaking because of you. That's it, I did it! Now I have fresh berry juice. To be precise, fresh beaten out berry juice. Smells good. Mmm, so sweet. Well, these kids surprise me sometimes. I'm gonna make orange fresh for granddaughter. Something's gone wrong. Granny, you've overestimated yourself. So that's what you're up to? We'll see about that. I'm old, but still strong. Look at my biceps. I used to be an athlete when I was young, so I can easily deal with a couple of oranges. Done. I've made it tasty. And what's more important, healthy orange fresh. Wow. Who cares? I'm gonna make a real cocktail. That's easy with a blender. All I need is to put the fruits into it and press the button. <laughs> <laughs> she's showing off once again. The machine's doing everything for her, and she's happy. Yes, Granny. This is called modern technologies. A couple of seconds, and a tasty cocktail is ready. All I need is to decorate it. Great! Awesome! Oh, I've made up something. Hey, Lola, look. Is that a bird over there? I'll put a secret ingredient in her cocktail. That's gonna be fun. Granny, don't betray me. Oh, I don't know. It must have flown away. Annie, we're ready. Woo! Wow, all the cocktails are so nice. Whoa. I'll start with the most beautiful. Hmm, taste orange. Uh -huh. Is this chili pepper? Oh, my face is burning. She's blowing fire out of her mouth. Cool. Whoa, it's over. But I'm definitely not going to choose this cocktail. What's next? Okay. What are all these berries here for? Strange. Ugh, that's so sour. Disaster. Granny, everything depends on you now. Let's try. Wow, really tasty. We have a winner. Hooray. There were no doubts. I'm the winner. What? A little pepper? I'm a bit less lucky. A huge hot pepper? No. You are kidding. Ladies, go first. Chloe, start. Hope it won't be too spicy. Blech. Chloe, hold on. It's not that bad. So it burns a bit. Phew, it's better now. <laughs> Lola, you are next. Oh, the smell makes me want to cry. Mm. Idea. Maybe it won't be too spicy if I make a cocktail out of it. I'll push the button and my pepper transforms into a drink. Something tells me that the taste has not changed at all. Uh... Lola, maybe this umbrella can cheer you up. <laughs> what a silly thing. Somebody is gonna feel sick now. What's going on? My eyes became lasers! Lola, you will set everything on fire, here! There you go. Thank you. Good, it's only the umbrella that was damaged. Seems it's my turn now. 
I should eat it really quickly so I will not feel its heat. Wow! Yuck! Are you still okay? That's all. I did it! And I'm burning! Oh dear! We need to save Nick! Oh, so refreshing! Nick, is everything all right? What a cute little bottle! Mine is bigger! <laughs> wow! Cool! I'm really lucky! I adore Sprite! Even though my bottle is small, the drink is tasty! Oh, it's jelly! So much fun! What's the matter? I can't get any more! Well, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a loser. You can look and be jealous. Jelly is coming out of the bottle. So funny. Wow. That's very delicious indeed. Hey, Nick, can you be more careful? Oops, Oops. sorry. Fine, my turn. <clears throat> Come on, I can't squeeze it out at all. I have an idea. I am a born karate master. What is going on? Are you ready? Hiya! Lola, we are all dirty now. Come on, the jelly is nice. A mini chocolate? What a pity. <laughs> I have a normal one. Have a look at my large chocolate. That's so cool. <laughs> Okay, I'll start first. The chocolate is good, but it's oh. tiny. Lola, can you share yours? Dream. I know how we can make a chocolate bar endless. Cut there. Then here. Cut off a piece. And move details. Oh la la, the chocolate looks like it's new. But I have a piece in my hand. Very tasty. I'll do it some more times. I came up with such a great idea. If you have endless chocolate, can I take a piece? Ouch! It's my bar. Chloe, it's your turn. Finally, mm. I can't wait to try it. But I'll do it a special way. Hmm? I'll put all the chocolate in a pot. And heat it. Safety comes first. Especially when you're holding a burner. What? Done. Mmm, this smell. Now it's time to try it. Hope it will be delicious. Yeah, gorgeous. <laughs> I have an idea! Enjoy your meal, Chloe! Did you see her face? It's hilarious! All right, here's for you, Nick! Again, my bad luck! What? Well, I like it! Wow, large ice cream! Ouch, cold! That's not fair! Okay, a small ice cream is better than nothing at all. Wow! Oh, it's already gone! Lola, eat yours! With great pleasure! So yummy! Let's make an ice cream on a stick! This way, it's even tastier and more comfortable! Looks awesome! That's all! I finished! This means it's my turn now! Oh no! It's too frozen! Chloe, give me a try! <laughs> I have an idea! Have you ever seen an ice cream bomb? Have a look! Now we light the fuse! And the magic will happen just in front of you! Oh, oh! <laughs> Something went wrong! Nick, you ruined everything as usual! Oh, I have a tiny piece of pizza! 
I have a regular one. <laughs> I've got an enormous one. I've never seen such a huge pizza. Hey. Lola, <laughs> you go first. I got it. I won't be full with just this piece, but it will be fine for my doll. I'll give her a little snack. Pretty tasty. Baby, help yourself. Lola, you are still playing with dolls? <laughs> My oh. dolly, and Nick, you're hopeless. <laughs> the pizza looks very yummy. So delicious. It's pepperoni, my favorite. Such a pity that it's already over. Here we go. So heavy. It's gonna be great. Pizza is so large. It's not very comfortable to eat it. I'll roll it, so it'll be much easier and quicker. Come on, Nick, you'll do it! This is so hard! The last piece! Hooray! Well done! Oops! First of all, I want a croissant! Uh. Croissants sound tasty, but how do I cook it? Grandpa and Chef have already made a paste. It's high time I start cooking, too. What's the word for? Ah, flour and eggs. To mix it all. Ugh, it's so sticky. I need a plan B. Exactly. Seems like the phone is calling. Hello? Say no more. Everything will be ready very soon. My croissant is already baked. I'll coat it with some delicious sugar syrup and add a little bit of topping to decorate it. <laughs> Grandpa, don't make me jump. My iPhone fell right into the paste. Oh, no. Oh, teens and their problems. When I was your age, there was no iPhones at all. Okay, my croissant with raisins is almost ready. Hey, look. My yummy croissant is baked. All I need is to add some filling. Berry cream cheese will be the best option. I'll hide the cut with chocolate chips. And that's it. Here's my croissant. Thank you so much. It's so beautiful. Smells wonderful. My timer says that the croissant is ready. Ouch! It's so hot! I'll decorate it with some sugar powder and it can be served! Achoo! Oh, it tickles my nose! Achoo! Oh no, my croissant! It looks like a flatbread now! <laughs> I'll show you how to cheat! <laughs> Roxy, we're ready! Well, let's have a look! What happened to it? It's crumpled. But tastes pretty good. The next is from Grandpa. A bit worse than Lola's, but generally it's good. What's next? Mmm, wow, delicious! There were no doubts. Mmm, I know. I want some chips. Oh, that's easy. If I'm not mistaken, I need potatoes. Do I need a knife to peel it? No thanks. It's a digital age, finally. I've got an electric vegetable peeler. Delicious. Wow, look at her. All about these potatoes. It's too boring. I'll make chips from corn tortillas. Or simply, nachos. Original and tasty. Corn triangles are ready. All I need is to cook them. I'll use this frying pan. Grandpa, mind your dish. Oh, 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 I don't care. Since what time is it banned to look at your nachos? My chips are too thick. Uh, I don't mind. I'll read a book while they're being cooked. How can I cut potatoes then? Idea. I'm gonna need a vegetable shredder. Let's put the future chips on the frying pan. And let's add some spices. <laughs> My yummy nachos are almost ready. A little bit of spice. 
but something's still missing. Exactly. Cheese sauce. Ready. Cheese and nachos are a perfect combination. My chips are also ready. What's that smell? Grandpa, it's burning! Holy lord, my chips! Oh no, I've spoiled them. Roxy, we're ready. Ek, what's that? I'm not gonna eat coals. As for these triangles, I'll try them with great pleasure. Could have been better. What about Lola's? Wow, delicious! Now it's time for a bagel! What is it? Chef, help! Okay, look carefully. Let's cut a roll into two pieces and make toast. Now the filling, I'll have a bagel with bacon. I got it! It's like a sandwich of an unusual form! I'll make a bagel with my favorite vegetables right from my garden! The most healthy foods! Onions, tomatoes, and an avocado! My granddaughter loves it! She says it's very popular now! Now let's cut the roll, just like the chef showed, and put all the ingredients inside! Indeed, my granddaughter has given us a difficult task. They always find something in the net and then make me cook for them. As for me, a scramble will be an ideal filling. Ready. I hope my granddaughter will appreciate it. The rolls got brown. It's high time to combine everything. Let's put some fried bacon and a couple of cheese slices inside. The final touch, a piece of edible gold. This roll looks like a donut. Why not make a sweet bagel? I'll take some delicious Nutella for a filling and cut my bagel carefully. Now, let's take some white chocolate. Roxy likes it very much. I put the pieces on top and voila! My sweet bagel is ready! <laughs> I'm dying to try them all! Grandpa's bagel looks strange, but there's an avocado inside. I don't like it. Chef, what do you have? Bacon and cheese are a cool combination! Delicious! Lola's bagel is the most original! Okay, I'll give it a try! Mmm, very tasty! Lola, you win! Now I'm thirsty! Make me some juice! Hey, the younger first! I'll choose the ingredients first! I'll pick it at random! Look what I made up! <laughs> she picked pepper. Come on, cook! I'm definitely out of luck. Indeed. Oh, have you ordered juice? I'll make her favorite orange juice. Cooking using only one ingredient? Too easy. I'll make a fruit smoothie for Roxy. I wonder what pepper juice will taste like. Maybe it won't be that bad. I need to try it first. I won't make it with my bare hands. I'm lucky to have a cool juicer. With the help of it, I'll quickly make my drink. That's pretty difficult. I need strong hands. Ugh, it's ready. Smells rather strange, though. The juice in the glass. Even if it's not so tasty, I can still serve it originally. Our tastes differ. There's nothing more useful than my hand squeezer. A bit of effort. And my juice is ready. Let's take a glass and pour it carefully. 
Mmm, delicious! Let's put a straw and it's ready. My fruits are mashed evenly. So my drink is also ready. I'll add some sugar powder. Ideal. Roxy, try it. Wow, they're so different. I'll start with the red one. How disgusting, it's just awful. Looks strange. No, I don't like it, it's too thick. Grandpa, I hope at least you won't disappoint me. Yes, exactly what I wanted. Grandpa wins. You don't have to follow the rules when cooking. Feel free to use your imagination. Just enjoy it. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to Olala, oh not to miss new funny stories.